Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning to you. October 9, 2019. What's the energy? What's the energy? Two of swords. Two of Swords, King of Pens, Ten of Cups. Ten, ten. Okay. <clears throat> you need to make a decision when it comes to what's next. I don't, looks like this can be feminine, masculine. It really just depends who you are when it comes to what the circumstance is. It looks like at the end of the day, it, it's wanting to be happy. Okay. It's laying the weight down. So there's something heavy that's creating this weight. Now, can it be every single day? Yes, we choose to carry this. But someone's not making a decision. So if you're not making a decision, it's, it's heavy. This gentleman is... I've lost you. Hold on. This gentleman is walking towards a tower. Feminine. Masculine. Doesn't matter. Wanting eternal happiness this someone's wanting eternal happiness because I, I just keep hearing the word eternal 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 okay <clears throat> this is going to bring you to the three of swords if somebody does not decide there is a feminine that needs to decide a situation when it comes to the king of pence or is the, it is the king of pence trying to decide okay but the thing is, I'm hearing the word eternal. So if eternal is being used, this is something, this is a serious situation, okay? Um, there's some type of division. There's like two different properties I'm looking at. I'm looking at happy, I'm looking at heavy. There might be something with an H. There's a 10-10, there's a void. There's a chance for something here, an opportunity for something here. Someone needs to pursue something. Okay. If this is you, I will tell you, you are dealing with somebody who is stable. Okay. Um, just needing to make a decision. It does regard a foundation, a new start, maybe a fresh start. Wall in the energy of having to make choices and decisions. It's happiness at the end of the day. It's it's where you put your energy on getting there. So if this is not you, okay, then you need to do what you do on a daily basis. Shift your energy, focus it on you, what's important to you, where you want to go, what you want to do, what puts a smile on your face. You can't worry about somebody else's decision. Worrying gets you nowhere. 
if you guys have the opportunity to, to figure this out together, then work on it. If not, don't carry someone else's weight. You stay in this frame of mind, visualization, because visualization can change your mind. It shifts your energy. Because it looks like, it looks like, Someone's trying to figure a certain situation out, right? So there's no clear intent because somebody's still trying to decide. So if this person, it, see, it's, it's, it's heavy. I don't know if there's fear here or not. I don't, There's there's got to be a hold up, whatever this is. Okay. Like for instance, say... It's just someone's not clear. And when someone's not clear, okay, say you think of something scary, it automatically goes into a survival pattern. You know, on the other hand, if love is 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 the root of it, you know, it's it's up to that person you know, um, to, to create a, a softer energy in their life so they can get to this uplifting place where they want to be. So someone has some, some work to do on, on how to get to this, how to get to their happy. I think going towards, I think somebody's thinking going towards happy will help with the weight. Whether this is you deciding about him or him deciding about you, the King of Pence is a very solid, sturdy, reliable king. You might need to cut some slack. But you gotta know if, if, you got to know the length of the rope, guys. You got to know your situation. It doesn't make any sense for me to clarify the two of swords because it's a decision. It's not made yet. So if there's something you want, state it. If it happens to be on the other end of the spectrum, then you continue doing what you do. But I suggest you focus on the ten of the cups. Because once the decision is reached, ultimately this is your goal. There's a chance for two new cycles here. A new life with less stress. Okay. Um... Could this be fantasy? Possibly. This could be you daydreaming. But if you're daydreaming, you're not taking action. And it's causing this. So if that's the case, you got to snap out of that. Because to me, that's saying someone's still wearing the blindfold. Okay. Somebody wants something back. And that's hard because everyone's situation is different. Tell me about the two of swords. <clears throat> Someone's definitely going through a dark night of the soul. I don't know if somebody feels left out. They're just lonely. They're upset. Not really knowing the situation. Um, maybe feeling a little bit of lack of comfort right now. It really just depends. Okay. But to me, 
the, the nine of swords, guys, is, is it's a good thing too because that's someone addressing their own demons, okay, uh, to get to a healthy scenario. So, I think regardless at the end of the day, whether it's you, whether it's him or her, him, her, or him, it doesn't matter how it goes. Ultimately, just keep going on throughout your day, thinking about happy, happy thoughts, visualizing happy thoughts, not fantasizing, visualizing. Okay, that's what's going to help you. Somebody is like finding your your authentic self. Somebody needs to find who they really are. What they really want. <clears throat> it is what this is telling me. Somebody needs to... It's like wanting to experience, but not being able to get the full experience yet. So somebody still has to go through the whole dark night of the soul to find mind, body, spirit. <clears throat> chakra energy, chakra work could help this situation. That's why I suggest you start off with visualization. Because when you visualize in a positive way... You're creating your own connection to get to where you want to be. Okay. I love you guys. I hope that helps. Bye.